My name is Chai Woodruff. I'm a product manager with Rely on Battery. In this Tech Tuesday, we're going to discuss some of the things to consider when switching your RV to lithium. Here are some questions we're commonly asked about the install. Will my RV be able to charge a lithium battery? Usually the answer is yes. The easiest way is to check your RV's fuse box. Most will list the specifications of the electrical system, which includes the converter or inverter your RV is equipped with. If you have access to it, you can also check the owner's manual. In this trailer, the converter output is 13.6 volts DC at 15 amps. Our re recommended charge voltage for 12 volt batteries is between 14.2 and 14.6 volts. Although the voltage output is a little low, the battery will attain about a 90% charge at the 13.6 volt 15 amp, amp output of the stock converter. We also reached out to WFCO, the manufacturer of the converter, and they confirmed the stock unit is able to charge a lithium battery. They also offered an upgraded converter that will charge the battery to 100% for about $250. Is lithium a drop-in replacement? In most cases, the answer is yes. Most RVs are on a 12 volt system, but some newer luxury trailers or coaches may be on 24 or 48 volts. Be sure to understand the system you're converting from. We have solutions for all systems. In this example, we're switching the stock Group 24 lead acid 64 amp hour to a Rely on Lithium 100 amp hour Group 31. In this case, it's as simple as removing the old battery and securing the positive and negative ring terminal to the new battery. As mentioned, the stock battery is a Group 24, so we had to replace the battery box with one that would fit a Group 31. You can order them at most auto parts stores or Amazon. You can use the hardware that secured the previous box to your trailer frame to secure the new one. Is there anything else I need besides the battery? Besides ensuring the battery will fit in the storage area, we also suggest a method to secure the storage box, like a locking steel core tie-down strap or a steel lock box. A lithium battery is an investment that could last 10 years or more, so you want to be sure it's secure against theft. Your battery will arrive with hardware attached, and even if you need to replace the storage box, the whole install, including attaching your RV ring terminals to the battery, should take about 20 minutes. Please wear protective gear, including gloves and eye protection, and use a wrench with insulated rubber handle. Also, be sure to adhere to all safety instructions in our product manual. If you need help determining a suitable replacement for your RV, please don't hes hesitate to contact us for more information. If you have any questions you'd like answered in a Tech Tuesday, please reach out to us on LinkedIn, Instagram, Facebook, or our website, and we'll do our best to feature it on a future Tech Tuesday video. Thanks for watching.